Fasten your seatbelts, get ready for this next band. They're making their way down our parade route. They call themselves the AOB. It is their first appearance in the Rose Parade. Here is the Tennessee State University Aristocrat of Bands. Here they come. Take a listen in just a second. All thanks to Kickin' It, California. Now, I said they call themselves the AOB band, but actually they were called that. So here's the story. The Band of Aristocrats uh, has many firsts. In 1955, they were the first historically black college band to appear on national television during an NFL football game. That was the Rams-Bear game. But in fact, they were dubbed that name by a sportscaster during that performance. They were called the Aristocrat of Bands during that football game, and that's how the name stuck. Love these performances. These ladies are owning their part of the boulevard. You know, they have a huge catalog. This is what shows why they're so versatile. Their catalog of music, they play big band jazz. They'll play classical music. They do all the popular arrangements that are so familiar to all of us. It was all put together by director Reginald McDonald and his assistant director, Larry Jenkins. Boy, are they filling up the space here with that sound, huh? You know, some people live for the band. Some live for the horses, some yeah. love all the flowers. We love it all, but when the music is being played in front of this audience, it just is magic. You know, they, you can tell that they are trying to lay down a really good first impression. That's it. Like, that is probably one of the loudest bands I can remember. And it makes it feel like a parade, and we are so happy to be back this year. Look at this one, Mark. The colors. Wow. It's always a beautiful float from City of Hope. This is the past president trophy winner. It's a floral masterpiece. As you know, City of Hope is a world-class leader in cancer care, proudly from the city of Duarte. Their float is called Garden of Hopes and Dreams, and it really provides positive inspiration for all of us. You see those uh, gorgeous native California butterflies catching her eye. All of them, the wings are flapping. They are among the flowers and assorted mushrooms that are found in this beautiful garden, symbolizing hope, rebirth, and renewal that happens every single spring. The butterflies also represent the City of Hope's patients who dream of hope, who dream of rebirth and renewal, of being cancer-free. Following a City of Hope tradition, you will find DNA strands on this float, which represent the City of Hope's pioneering research strategically placed on this float. Two of them are in the front with the butterflies, and then if you look in the back, disguised with the mushroom stems, that's the other...